Hey friend, uh, if you're here, you're here because I've got a trading story for you, and so welcome. Once upon a time, eight years ago, eight years ago? Eight years ago, a friend came to the office. He won a contest on my podcast to come to the office, and I would spend a week with him teaching him how to trade. So on a random Monday in March, I get a knock at the office door. Back then I had this giant office with like a little basketball court inside of it and a pool table and all this kind of fun stuff. But I was usually there just by myself. And so there's this knock at the office door. And I open the door and there's this guy with a beard. And I'm like, who is this guy? <laughs> and I'd totally forgotten that he won the contest, that I had flown him out and that he was there. And he showed up at the doorstep and I just thought, I don't even want to do this. I don't want to spend a ton of time teaching somebody else how to trade. Little did I know, this guy would be the best trader that I ever knew, ever met, ever taught, ever worked with. For the next four days, I sat at my desk and he sat across from me over there. He'd say, what do you want me to test? What do you want me to trade? What do you, what do you want to teach me? And I would say, okay, well just do this. Just um, anytime price goes away from a pivot point, I want you to start trading back to that pivot point. He'd do a little bit of work. He'd come back up and go, all right, well, what's my stop loss? And then I'd give him an answer. And then he'd go back down and he'd get back to work. And a few minutes later, he would jump up and he'd say, hey, what about my, um, what about my profit target? Could I put it a little bit above or below the pivot? I'd give him an answer and then he'd go back to work. And over the next four days, he came in every day, I talked to him a little bit every day, and then he did a ton of back testing. And back then, in those days, we were using back test software that you moved it forward, candle by candle by candle by candle, and then you took a trade, and then it marked it, and then it marked the exit, and then it marked the entry, and then it marked the drawdown. And basically, at the end of four days, he had back tested 1,500 different trade setups and over 10,000 trades more than I'd ever seen anybody do. He would leave my office at 3 or 4 p.m. He'd go back to his little hotel at the Best Western, this cheapo garbage hotel down the street from my office, and he would keep testing until midnight. And then he'd wake up at 7 o'clock in the morning, he'd come back to the office, and he sat there, and he just put his head down, and he did a ton of testing. Lesson one, the first lesson of all of this, is he did a ton of testing before he ever took a live trade. He showed up at my office, and he did his own work. He asked me a very few small number of questions and then he did testing. And that testing would prove to him whether the system worked or not. Well, did the system work or not? That's the subject of the very next video. So thanks for watching this video. What you can do now is stay tuned on YouTube. You should be watching, uh, the next video should just play right away inside of the playlist. So uh, let's go to part two.